in this video, you're going to learn how to use watercolor brushes, as well as how to clean them after you're done using them in class. Before you start watercoloring, you need to activate your watercolors by simply taking your paintbrush, dipping it in water, and then putting it on top of your watercolor pans. Classroom rule number one, never take your brush and smash it into the color pan, just like shown. Never do that. Simply gently apply pressure into the color pan. When you're working with watercolor, after you load up your brush with the, whatever color you desire, never smush the bristles like this. Never. Never spread the bristles. That is a big no. So what you're going to be doing is taking your color and gently applying that, making sure that all the bristles are staying together. They may like flare out a little bit, but never splay them out. So let's just say that you're painting your, your little painting. You need to pay attention to what part of the brush you are working with. Try and stay with the tip. If you use the end of it, that is fine, but remember to keep the hair together. Let's say you were wanting to mix two colors to get a brand new color. So you load up your paintbrush with the first color, you put that loaded up color onto your watercolor palette, you clean off your brush, and you load up the second color, and you put it on your paint palette. What I don't want to see, which follows my second classroom rule, is you are to never mix colors into watercolor pans. That's a big classroom no. Never mix colors in the watercolor pans. The reason why is because as the actual color dries, that set second new color is always going to be on top of the first color. So what was a beautiful yellow might be green, might be brown, but you're really wanting that true yellow color. Classroom rule three is going to be talking about how to clean up and put away your watercolor palette and your brush. After you're done painting, you're going to walk over to the sink. You're either going to carefully either put your palette into your cubby or back in the cupboard. The thing I don't want to see is where you take your brush and you throw it into the sink. This is a classroom three, no. What you're going to do instead is you are going to wash your brush by simply taking your opposite palm and swirling the brush bristles into your palm, allowing the water to go through and around your brush bristles. Carefully rinse it off again, and then flick off any extra water, turn off the sink, and besides the sink, there is going to be some metal containers. You're then gonna very carefully take your paintbrush and put it hairdo bristles up into the container. Thank you for watching this video. If you need any further help on any specific watercolor techniques, feel free to email me through the Gmail or put a question through the Google Classroom um, stream. Until then, see you next time.